All right, we made it to the track with Clayton's Mark I. For those that don't know, this is a, obviously, Mark I GTI. It's got a 1AT swap in it, and it's running Haltech Elite 1500. Although it's basically a race car, it's really only ever used for lapping and time attack. For those that have been following along for a while, you guys would have seen this on the channel multiple times. But this is our first lapping day of the season, and uh, Clayton's just gonna get out. The last time we headed out, we actually were drag racing it, so we gotta make sure the boost is turned down so that he stays safe and has lots of fun. Clayton, you ready to do some lapping today? Definitely, definitely. It's been too long. Too long, I think I'm gonna have to zoom in. Nope. So uh, maybe take some, uh, some peeps out in the car today as well? Yeah, it's usually, it can be a little sketchy. I don't normally, Super enjoy that just because it's this car. It's a bit of a handful. Yeah, it's a it's a handful. That's a good thing. But so, uh, to yeah. let what? Go ahead. Sorry. No, you go, go ahead. ahead. You go ahead. I was gonna say to let people know this car made just over 400 wheel horsepower on ethanol. It is running ethanol today. However, we can turn it down. <laughs> we're gonna probably, probably turn it down. like. Turn it down a little bit, but Clayton had found a boost or a wastegate leak yesterday, and uh, Super it might be a little spicy, so we might have to adjust it a couple times before it gets a little more dialed in. Usually, just over 300 horsepower, I think, is what it's run at. Usually, but around there. Yeah, but I mean, it's, we'll it has been that long, so right, yeah. yeah. So, lots to do. Get it ready. We'll get to the track. Hopefully, get some onboard footage and stuff like that for you guys today. So. Enjoy!
tight. tight. It's gonna be tight. Okay. Okay. Make sure you get the lap belts tight. Like a Ferris wheel. No, stop making fun of me. I'm scared enough. You feel tight? Oh yeah. Okay. I'll take it slow the first lap, okay? We'll only go out for a couple laps. Yeah, take it slow, please. Yeah. <laughs> Have fun! Alright, so you ready? It all depends on who you trust, I guess, and okay. for some reason you trust me, so. I was just casual looking out the window. <laughs>
gas instead of the brake. The brake's super close to the gas pedal. Dave hates it. I'm going to have to change it. So how was it? Yeah, I'm sweaty. Sweaty? Long oh. day? Oh my god. You look like you look like the same footage I took earlier. Almost. Almost. Yeah. I'm always sweaty and gross. So how was it? First it was day awesome. out. Yeah, it was really good. Yeah, the boost was uh, this morning. Boost was definitely a bit on the high side. You took what ten percent? Ten percent duty out. Yeah. So but obviously good. that wastegate must have been leaking for a while. So. Good thing I did because uh, it made 400 wheel at 20 pounds of boost and I took 10% duty cycle out of it and his first lapping session out it was making 20 pounds of boost so it would have been high high boost then. Yeah and I don't know you'll probably have footage but like on the front stretch it was like fourth gear and it was just doing this. Frying like, the tires yeah, yeah sliding all over. Yeah but so, yeah throughout the day it got awesome you took a little bit out right? I took yeah I took more than a little bit out. Um, but this is the first time, I don't think, aside from the video we would have posted last year from the drag strip, yep. this car hasn't been to this track in almost two years, Yeah, really. So It was the end of 21. But 21, yeah. yeah. So we are finally got it back out. It's packed up. Well, we're just about to pack it up. Yeah. And it runs, and it's not broken, no. and nothing's happened other than a little bit of heat. heat head around. Yeah, yeah. Head around. So that's it. So if you guys have any questions or comments, if you enjoy this type of video, be sure to like. Subscribe. We'll see you in the next video. Bye. Bye. Clayton, we're back. We're back because we jinxed ourselves. We jinxed ourselves, and the fuel pump just pooped the bed. Yeah, right we now. went. Yeah, we went to load it on the trailer, and there's no prime. So, womp womp. Till next time. Okay, fuel pump's out. It's the next day. Clayton is uh, replacing it with an AEM pump. It's a, basically a drop in this surge tank. Um, I would have built this a long time ago, but it used. Uh, IE plate that used Bosch 044 pumps. We're swapping the Bosch 044 pump out for an AEM pump, which is actually ethanol compatible. The other one wasn't, which is likely why it seized up and died. No. No, Clayton says no. So um, we should have this running again in a few minutes. Yay. Clayton, let's hear it. Mmm, <laughs> sounds like it's gonna work. Sounds a bit better. Sounds promising. Let's see, see what your starter sounds like though.